Hello everybody, it's Emily, and I thought I'd do a tutorial on how to edit your own skins. So I make a lot of skins for people, and I thought it would be a good idea to show you how I do it, so you can do it exactly how you want. So I use Nova Skin, it's really easy and fun to use, and good to get the hang of. I mean, once you get the hang of it, it's pretty fun. So, what you want to do, usually, is find a skin online. I have found uh, this one. So, usually... You, I w to start, I would get a skin of yourself and then make it basically look like you're naked. You'll see what I mean. I have it uh, saved right here. See, this is my <laughs> base skin I use because when I erase and put things on top, that's uh, I just have my skin underneath. So you want to have that one on the bottom, and then you take the one that you want to put on that you want to put the clothes in, and you put it on top. So. There it is. So obviously that does not look like me at all. So what I do is I just start erasing things. Now Nova Skin, I'll zoom in so you can see. When you try to erase overlay, it does it like that. So if you right click twice, double click, double click, and it gets rid of that whole area. So I want to get rid of those headphones because I don't like them, and whatever that is. So there we go. Now I just click this to get rid of the overlay and then start right, double right clicking to reveal my face. See, it's right underneath and it only erases the top girl's layer. So there I am. I like to do mirror arms and legs so I can erase the hands. See, you don't need to right click anymore. There are my hands and now I can double right click here. So basically it's starting to look like me a little bit. Uh, the thing that's bugging me right now is the hair. And so when I erase, I can see my hair underneath. I like it. Yep, but as you can still see, there's all this red here. So you want to press this, which is the color tool. And you want to get the eyedropper and kind of like eyeball it, I guess. You know, just be really careful. Oops. Sometimes it doesn't grab. Uh, I don't know what this looks like. It's going to be tough, so you got to kind of use your imagination. There. Yeah. All right. That's cool, but my legs, as you can tell, that is not my skin color, so just start erasing. Here we go, my legs. Okay, so now we got that part of the body done. You gotta f always remember to do the inside of the arms by getting rid of the body right there. So there you go, your arms. And you always want to double check, see if there's anything here. Nope, looks like we're good. So, as if you noticed, that is not my hair. It's majestic, but it really isn't my hair. So I just start erasing finding my hair first. Good enough for me. <laughs> so now make sure to do the inside of legs too. Careful. There, because it'll copy. Now you want to check everything. The top of the head, the bottom of the legs. Make sure the tops of the body, bottom of the body right there. Okay. And this is a part I always forget, the top of the body, so you just want to get rid of the head. Yep, see, that would look really weird when I look around. So, I always have that. So that's what my head looks like. And you can basically do anything you want, if you want to fix it up in any way, but I'm just showing you how to put your own head onto different clothes and make it look like you're wearing them. a cute little pink outfit. I won't really wear it, but you know what? I need to demonstrate. Oh, what is that? See, these are weird things. I just got a color variation. Turn that off. There. Now you want to be super careful that you got everything. So now, how to save it, if you press save, you'll kind of look at this, see if there's anything you missed, and if that doesn't look like I missed anything, save image as. I usually click on desktop, and then I just call it like M pink or something, and there it's saved. Now if you want to make them Alex, because sometimes when you upload it, there's this really weird glitch that happens with your arms. So you go to the Alex thing up there and you press open. You go to M pink. You can see, look at the hands, they're pink on the bottom. Now this place is a, it's weird. You can't just like edit it like this because that's the overlay. And uh, you just kind of have to click, click this and you cl click twice to zoom in onto that. There we go. And now I just don't worry about color variation. I just choose and I just... That looks like it's about it. So what I would do is I would save this 
download, save image as M Pink Alex. Just so you know, make sure it's on desktop, save. And then you just upload that to Minecraft as normal. So that's basically it. Thanks for watching, and I hope I helped you figure out how to edit anything you wish. And that's how you put your own head onto other bodies. So just, you know, like, comment, subscribe, join Aria, all that stuff. Okay, see ya. Bye.